Hi, I'm Jonathan, lead developer on WP Layouts, and this is a demo of how to use WP Layouts to export content created with the WordPress block editor, also known as Gutenberg. I will also cover how to import that content into a page on a different site. For this video, we will be using this sample page created in the block editor. If we want to export this entire page to our WP Layouts cloud storage, we can use this handy Export to WP Layouts button under Import Export Layout in the right sidebar. All we need to do is provide a name for our layout, click Export, and away we go! Alternatively, we can choose only part of our page to export. We can export a single block by clicking it, then opening the block menu by clicking the three dots in the toolbar above the block, and clicking the Add to WP Layouts button. This opens up the same dialog box as before, and the export process is the same. If we want to export more than one block, we simply select multiple blocks. Currently, the block editor allows you to make a multi-block selection by selecting one block, then holding the shift key while selecting another block. Both blocks and any blocks in between will be selected. Opening the menu will once again provide an Add to WP Layouts option which works the same as it does for a single block. Now here is a blank page on a different site that we want to import our block-based content into. This site needs to have all of the blocks in the layout installed in order for them to work correctly. There are two ways we can do the import. First, we can click the Add Block button wherever it appears, such as at the top left of the page or above an existing block. Then we can either search for our layout by name or expand the My WP Layouts heading and select it. This will cause the layout to be inserted at the position corresponding to the Add Block button. Alternatively, we can click the Import from WP Layouts button under Import Export Layout in the right sidebar, select the My Layouts tab if necessary, find and select our layout, choose where we want the layout to be inserted relative to any existing content, and click the Import button. That's all! This has been a demonstration of WP Layouts used with the WordPress Block Editor. For more information on WP Layouts, check out our website at wplayouts.space.